Hello everyone, welcome to Root to Mathematics. In this video, we are going to solve this interesting entrance examination questions. So here we have given x multiplied with 3x plus 4 multiplied with 3x plus 8 multiplied with x plus 4 equals to 16. And here we are asked to find the value of x. Okay, so without any delay, let's just start the solution. So what we have given, we have given x multiplied with 3x plus 4 multiplied with 3x plus 8 multiplied with x plus 4 equals to 16. Okay, in the first step, let us assume t being a variable equals to x plus 2. So, this implies this we can write x equals to t minus 2. Okay, now we will put the value of x in the above equation. So, the above equation becomes t minus 2 multiplied with 3 multiplied with t minus 2 plus 4 multiplied with 3. Again, we will put the value of x here. So, here we will put t minus 2 plus 8. Here also t minus 2 plus 4 equals to 16. Okay, this implies this. Here we have t minus 2 multiplied with 3t minus 6 plus 4 multiplied with 3t minus 6 plus 8 here t minus 2 plus 4 become plus 2 equals to 16 this implies this t minus 2 multiplied with 3t minus 2 multiplied with 3t minus 6 plus 8 becomes plus 2 t plus 2 equals to 16. Okay, this implies this. Now, I will rearrange the equation. So, I will write t plus 2 multiplied with t minus 2. Okay, multiplied with 3 t plus 2 multiplied with 3 t minus 2 equals to 16. Here, I will apply an algebraic formula. And here also apply the same algebraic formula that is a plus b multiplied with a minus b equals to a square minus b square. So, in this term I will consider a as t and b as 2 and for this term we will consider a as 3t and b as 2. Now, applying the algebraic formula we can write t square minus 4 multiplied with 9t square minus 4 equals to 16. This implies this. Now multiplying t with 9t square again t square with minus 4. We have 9t to the power 4 minus 4t square. Again minus 4 will multiply with 9t square and again with minus 4. So here we have minus 36 t square plus 16. Now, I will take this 16 to the left hand side. This will become minus 16 equals to 0. So, here you can see that here we have positive 16 and negative 16 get cancelled out. So, this implies this 9 to, to the power 4 minus 40 t square equals to 0. Okay. So, this implies this. Now, I will take t square common. So, here we have 9 t square minus 40 equals to 0. Now, from here we can directly write t square equals to 0 and 9 t square minus 40 equals to 0. Okay. We have taken t equals to x plus 2. Now, I will just put the value here. So, this implies this x plus 2 whole square equals to 0. So, from here x plus 2 equals to 0. This implies this x equals to minus 2 is one of the solution of the given equation. Now, for this equation, we also put t equals to x plus 2. So, this implies this 9 multiplied with x plus 2 whole square minus 40 equals to 0. This implies this 9 multiplied with, here we will apply the 
फॉर्मूला ए प्लस बी होल स्क्वायर दैट इज एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस फोर प्लस फोर एक्स माइनस फोर्टी इक्वल्स टू जीरो दिस इम्प्लाइज नाइन एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस थर्टी सिक्स प्लस थर्टी सिक्स एक्स माइनस फोर्टी इक्वल्स टू जीरो दिस इम्प्लाइज नाइन एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस थर्टी सिक्स एक्स हियर वी हैव प्लस थर्टी सिक्स माइनस फोर्टी दिस विल बिकम माइनस फोर इक्वल्स टू जीरो so here we have a quadratic equation we'll put the quadratic formula find out the value of x that is minus b plus so minus root under b square minus 4ac divide by 2a okay here a equals to 9 b equals to 36 and c equals to minus 4 these are a b c are nothing but the coefficient of the Given quadratic equation, now we will put a, b, c here. So this implies x equals to minus thirty six plus or minus root under thirty six square minus four multiplied with nine multiplied with minus four divided by two multiplied with nine. This implies x equals to minus thirty six plus or minus root under here four multiplied with nine is thirty six so I'll take thirty six common so thirty six plus four divided by eighteen this implies x equals to minus thirty six plus or minus if I take this thirty six outside the root over this will become six root forty divided by 18. This implies x equals to minus 36 plus or minus. Here I will take 4 outside the root over, so this will become 2. 2 multiplied with 6. Here we have 12 root 10 divided by 18. This implies x equals to. I'll take 6 common. 6 multiplied with minus 6 plus or minus 2 root 10. Divide by eighteen. Eighteen get cancelled out by six. Here we have three in the denominator, so this implies x equals to minus six plus or minus two root ten divided by three. Or you can write x equals to minus two plus or minus two by three root ten. Okay. So from here we have x equals to minus two. Minus two by three root ten. Another value of x is minus two plus two by three root ten. And previously we got x equals to minus two. These three are the answer of the given equation. I hope you have understood the solution. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my channel for more such interesting videos. Thank you.